Good afternoon. We're dealing with your cause for thought. And our cause for thought at the moment is the parables. We've read two of them and we made a decision that they seem to explain that the kingdom of heaven looks big but in fact is quite small. And we had a look at the dragnet to explain that to us. The dragnet's full of fish, but not all of them are good. It's the same as the kingdom of heaven. It may look full of people, but not all of them will be accepted. And so let's have a look and see what he says in that first parable again, where he says, a sower went out to sow seed, and some fell on the hard ground. Some fell on the rocky ground. Some fell on the thorny ground. And some fell on the good ground. And the disciples asked him, what, what, what are you saying? What do you mean by this? And he said, the sun fell on the hard ground, and the birds of the air came and ate the seed up. It didn't go in, it just fell on the solid, hard surface of the heart. And therefore, the birds, Satan, is quite easy, uh, quite able to easily take the seed away. And some fell on rocky ground. And it sprung up straight away because of the, the moisture. But when the sun came up, it dried it out and killed it. And he said, these are those who have got a shallow heart. And the seed can't really get in. It just rests on the surface. And then immediately they, they have a great joy. But... It doesn't last very long. And then some fell amongst thorny ground. And it sprung up. But the thorns sprung up as well. And the thorns choked it. And he said that represents someone who accepts the word of God. But the cares of this world and the concerns of other things choke it out but some fell on good ground and that produced some a hundredfold some sixty and some thirtyfold so we understand that there are four types of soil there and perhaps there are four types of soil in the church. There's the good soil, the hard soil, the rocky soil, and the thorny soil. Which one are you? Are you certain that you belong to the good soil? Are you bringing forth 30, 60 or 100 from? That's the important test. Think on these things. And we'll go into it more next time. God bless.